tonight? I hadn't planned on it, no. Plan on it. Minus five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery. You're gonna die. I'm Raymond Arroyo. We'll see you next time. Oh, we're live. Yeah, we're just going. Hi, everyone. Welcome back. Shut up. I thought that was one of those one of those drops where it's pause and then it's. But that's, that's, that's no. the encore. Um, Dang it. Okay. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the show. It's another episode of the show. Uh, we got Adrian and Colin in the closet here. Once yeah, again, in together in the closet. They love again. it. There's nothing we'd rather don't read into it too much. And we have Brittany and <laughs> Allie back on the show. Woo! They're both single. <laughs> uh, thanks for the reminder. Uh, I am on a new dating app, though. Ooh. So I'm on two I mean, now. That's so like, who knows? For next, next week, I might not be single. You might be married. Wait, I might be married. What's the new week? app? Hinge. That was last week we talked yeah, about Hinge. I thought yeah. you, we Every about episode, this. you've been on a new dating app. <laughs> well, no, was, last week, we? we broke down Hinge. We spent like yeah, we did talk 20 minutes about talking about week. it. Oh, yeah, I remember that. We spent about 20 <laughs> minutes. I thought it was a good oh, conversation. I'm I wasn't being critical. I'm still I not married. So. No, I'm being critical. We spent... 20 whole minutes on something okay. you forgot and you brought the topic that. up again. I just remember talking about our cool sneakers and preach a sneak guy. That was awesome. That's all I remember. Okay. I really liked having that guy on the show. Yep. I know. And we need to move on to this episode okay. and not topics okay. from last right. episode. That just means that people should listen to last week's Although, episode. Although, don't you think people should still drink studio coffee? Uh, Always. Yeah, I do. Actually, I'm going to pull up. If it works, I'm going to pull up yep. the old, just oh. give it a once just in a... give it a... Brittany, what are your updates from last week? Uh, you know... Okay, stop. Okay. <laughs> We have our first sponsor, mm-hmm. drinkstudiocoffee.com. Brittany, take it away. If you need to be caffeinated, you should buy a bag of studio coffee. It helps support. Thank you. That's been <laughs> drinkstudiocoffee.com. It's real. Yes. Episode. Edmund is on a ripper today. I'm so excited. Um, I've missed this Edmund for yeah, a while. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> I Can love I, it when it's like this. Uh, so. This is going to be great. What else we got, Allie? Uh, All right, moving on. Next week. <laughs> so um, we, got a, we got a package delivered okay, here. No, no, no. We yeah. got a package. Okay. We, the show Can you gals, show this? Kyle <laughs> gals. got a package. It says Brittany Anderson and Allie Hoffman to That's us. The, That's us. the show gals. Yes. We're the show gals. I'm so excited. Now, here's the thing. Okay. We don't know who this is from. Correct. Now, should we say, like, on the outside of the package, it does say, send a cake. Now. Send a cake. Could be a cake. Can we take votes or a bet? Can we bet on, Mm -hmm. is this from a male suitor? An admirer. A Mormon. Or a friend. (laughs) I'm going to say Mormon. (laughs) Because it's to both of you? Yeah. (laughs) Allie and I are going to be sister wives. Yeah. But you're not sisters. No, we but don't have to be we're sisters gonna have the same to be husband. sister wives. Yeah, yeah we have the right. same husband. Sister wives mean. Okay, yeah. okay. Okay, Edmund, yeah. why right. don't you open it for us? Then? Why would I open it for you guys? That's okay, then I'm, actually, then, no, no, no. Then I'm the married thing. to him. I don't want to well, be a sister wife. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I, Allie and I do get a lot of fan mail. We do. Okay. And uh, you know, I was talking to our hair and makeup person as we were getting ready, um, and I was just thinking about this box in particular because you had texted us that mm-hmm. we got some fan mail you were praying through it yeah i was just praying through Do and i, wanna, I uh, think i might know who it's from okay and um i really do think that you oh, should I'm do the honors well. wait you think i should open yeah it? because first of all the the way that they have the frame set up i just think but it's to the gals it's well, yeah I, but i, I well, think we it's can't both open it the i same think it's time. a cake but Wait, you want to move that water bottle out of the shot? Yeah. Now I'm really nervous. <laughs> I don't know what's in there. <laughs> it's send the cake. I think it's a cake. Oh, maybe frozen. Wow. But you think I should open it? Yeah. Well, we can't both open it. What is it? Tell us. Okay. It says, 
So here, if there's something that says, <gasps> says something on the top. Ooh, that box look how looks cute. amazing. Is now, that... now, do you think you know who it's from still? No. No. Oh, now different? Now you think it's I, different? I don't think it is what I thought it was. You thought it was going to be a box full of confetti, <laughs> don't you? <laughs> Didn't you? It says, what does it say? It says, to the show crew from a, oh, semin- the whole crew. a seminarian with an awkward last name. Okay. Close to Mormon. <laughs> you guys are the best. Here's a little something to celebrate a thousand followers and at wait and about at around a hundred episodes. Yes. And this is our 99th one. Now, We're what, so close. What seminarians, Kyle, do we know with an awkward last name? That, that's a great question. Uh do I know Brent, any seminarians? What's now, his last name? Do I open it this way? Can Metzler? you guys can you guys see it? Should I should we do center center cam here? Yeah. Or should we do cam. okay? Do now, yeah, but push it a lot closer to Brittany. Like this? Yeah, yeah. You You're can't gonna... see it where it was earlier. Oh, Hi, yes. yes. Okay. Now so you pull. This is really fun. Cake. This is really fun. Oh! <laughs> Happy ninety nine episodes! Yay! Yay! <laughs> I so don't want confetti <laughs> to be my bit. Like, I don't want confetti. The more that you fight it, the more it just embrace it. No, look at how much confetti this is. I love these ones. These are so cute. Those are so cute boxes. Wait, oh so, my gosh. So, this is the most elaborate. <gasps> wow. Wow. Show it oh, to the camera. Yes. <laughs> it has oh, a candle. candle. Okay, that's really cute. Okay, uh, that's super should cute. I go get a lighter? You open this, I'll go yeah, get a lighter. That is really cute. Do you think it's a Proctor Kyle last name? It's from it's from John. Oh, okay, it's from Seminary and John Dick. John Dick in Maryland? I don't know. In... Oh, 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 from Instagram. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, yeah. It's just not focused on that. I guess he didn't want us to say that. <laughs> oh. Well, oh, I mean, it is an awkward like, last name. Here, or I mean, maybe that's why he went to <laughs> seminary. <laughs> it's good to yeah, know. Okay, here's to 99 okay, episodes. Really thanks, John. Yes, this is thanks, awesome. John. Where's the... Um, thanks, Edmund loves thanks, future this. father John. Yes. Oh, here's a candle. He's a part... I think he's like... An, like he's not a regular seminarian, yeah. though. Oh, he's a cool seminarian. He's a super seminarian? No, no what does he's that like mean? with an or... Like, isn't he... A part of order? an order. Who, who is this from? Uh, this John is John Dick. Dick. Uh, yeah, uh, not, I've, not we talk, father, but we've talked a lot close. over the years on Instagram. And Sounds like a great dude. I want to make that clear. Yeah, yeah, he's cool. <laughs> yeah. It is uh, John Let's Dick ninety one. He's with O F. Wait, wait, what's? Oops, I got rid of him. What? Uh, o S F S. Order so, of the order super. Oh, probably St. Francis, Francis de Sales. Sales. Fra- oh yes, uh, yeah. So he wins that round. Oh yeah, yeah, no, this, yeah, yeah, no, this is John Dick. And then uh, he also knows, um, he's really cool, and he also knows uh, Craig Irwin, I think, who oh, I knew who's in. Oh, that? No, I don't. Know I knew that. him in Toledo, and I think I he's also in Oblates. He is a content now, creator. Is it Oblates or Oblates? Oblates. Oblate or is it Oblates? Uh, Oblate do or Oblate? Oblate. D. Don't. Oh, okay, so okay. who's okay, gonna Okay, what are we gonna out? sing? You. We normally sing before you. For he's okay. a jolly good fellow. For he's a jolly. Done. Good That's it. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Dear God. That was so really I knew you would do it. I knew you would actually do it. Dang, that, that was, was really real good. fear. What's under the cake? Really wow. Okay. Nothing. So <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I was just wondering Man, what's under the cake. Do we not have? Um, Thank you, forks. Fa- not quite, no, father. Just, Use your uh, sister fingers. Just, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, okay. Well. Uh, what else we got? We have other. Uh, we launched our website. Yeah, it looks so good. I mean, we are. I mean, we still have like every time, every day, we add more to it. So I love the about section with our whole crew. Now with that our face. Now, now that, that your I'm on face it. Is on it. <laughs> It is cool. Thank you, Anna. It does look really cool, but we're slowly working on it. So just like know that it's it, we're gonna keep adding stuff don't, to it. What are you? I okay, we All shouldn't right. give you fire. <laughs> uh, so bummerlazarus.co. Yes. Bummerlazarus.co. Check it out. It's super exciting. Uh, it is. Don't Google it. It's very tough to find if you Google. Really? Good. Good. Oh. Yeah. We want you to work hard for <laughs> yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. We but only want to work. When you land on it, you're like, wow, I'm blown away. <laughs> I took way too long to find this. We only want to work with clients that are. In the know, Grinders. really looking Wait, hard for us. We only want to work the gram. There's a link in the bio. We only want to work with clients that are uh, in the know. Um, Who's this? Oh, and then we gotta uh, keep this. Yeah, we gotta keep the one that says the show gals. Yeah. Uh, what other updates do we have? Um, 
Ben Kirby, that was a great interview was. last week. So check that out. Michael, the tornado of business Hoffman was on the show as well. <laughs> yeah, he's my favorite. Oh yeah. man, I lost connection to my stream deck here. Oh Aww. no. Um, oh no. <laughs> okay, here's what I want to bring up. Uh, all right, tell Kyle. us. Kyle. All right. Allie. Oh no. Do you want to, can you hand me my water? Yeah. Mm. That's it. Uh -huh. He needs okay. a drink. <laughs> so he's got to take, serious. he's got to take some Okay. Liquid Hold on in. one second. Oh gosh, here we go. Do some ASMR. <laughs> oh, no, that's what the show only does. It went up my nose. <laughs> no, what, what mic is Edmund? I'm turning it off. <laughs> so. Uh, Thanks what for the cake, John. Eat? Oh. It's my nicotine gum. Oh, okay. Yeah, Edmund eats um, nicotine gum, even though he's not a smoker. Well, I'm trying to develop the addiction. Oh, oh so you think this is That's like a gateway? Common. Well, I don't like cigarettes, so I feel like if I eat enough nicotine gum, then maybe one it's, day I'll like cigarettes yeah. and I'll start smoking Oh, that's them. nice. I've never heard of that. I do think that's a habit a lot of people want to develop. Smoking? What is this? Oh, I blew off the candle and now it's has <gasps> you wax, got wax all over on my mic. microphone. That's gross. Oh, And no. that's something all people can relate to. Yep. Wax on the microphone. Wax. So, Allie, let's go to... Uh, why don't you lead us in with... <laughs> Hi, this is Allie Hoffman with the news. Now you said that you had a different way you wanted to do it. Yeah, but I forgot. I have to Again? practice it. Practice it. I have to practice, practice. it. Practice. Oh, I How know what say? we can talk about. No, 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 Kyle. There's a link to Facebook to a video that someone took in Times Square. That's exactly what I was about I to say. I put it in here. <sighs> True. <laughs> You're lucky I didn't high five your okay. face. Okay, okay. Was everyone, mean. shut up. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Allie's famous. Before we press play, can you tell the story while Kyle gets the picture in picture so we can go? Huh. All right, guys. Okay, or you could just. <laughs> Look at that little car. I think it's playing somewhere that's else. A, that's an NYPD car too. Oh. It looks like a little. It was okay. playing in there. So my dad and I, when quarantine started, a big quarantine last year in 2020, my dad and I did a kitchen and a dance video in our kitchen that went viral. Mm -hmm. yep. And then a couple months later, Oreo was like, Mr. Hey, Oreo, Mr. Or? Oreo himself. Okay. Mr. O. Dot I thought Rio. you can't say Oreo. Ooh. We're gonna believe that. But out. O. Dot Rio. Oh uh, yeah. Then it's like a mystery. Who is it for? Yeah. Um, watch the video and you'll know. Don't so that. they Don't that. um. Don't believe that. So they reached out and they're like, "Hey, we really love the video. We'd love to um put it in part of this commercial that we're doing for at wow. home." We think you guys would help us sell more Oreos. Yeah, Oreos. and we're gonna give you a contract. And we we signed a contract. We did get money. We did get paid for it. A lot of people reached out and they're like, "Oh my gosh, are they paying you?" And all of a sudden, yes, I reached out and I said that. Yeah. I was like, "You better be getting paid for this." Yeah. And we're like, we'll sue him for more. <laughs> now, what were the specific, like, you don't have to share how much money, but uh -huh. I've Guess. I've always wondered. Okay, okay higher or okay, lower? Okay, okay. $10,000. Are you going to tell me higher or Can lower? You, her higher? eyebrows are going higher. No, definitely lower. Oh. <laughs> Wait, lower. What? Oreos? Oh, yeah. It, you they're get, like, owned by Nabisco, I think. I know. That's a big, they're a no. conglomerate. Well, it just depends on how many, how what they use it there, for. And there was a bunch of different videos in there. Yeah. But the thing is, you, we, you, I, I felt you like pay we for, did you pay for how many? Screwed. You pay for how many views? No. So you can't. What? That's not right. So you can't retire oh. off of this income. <laughs> no, what? no, 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 no. What I want to know is what I want to know is no. the specific. Yeah, do you get royalties? Yeah, you should get residuals. No. Royalties. She signed so her rights away. She didn't signed... talk to the You need an Lazarus. agent. Yeah, you need. If an this agent. happens to you, call us. We, we won't let this happen. Yeah. We signed a contract for a certain amount of time. However, with this coming out, this is grounds for. It's we think our contract is over, so why are they still using mm -hmm. it? So we have to go back and look because we signed a six-month contract. And that was for um, TV. So we were on TV, and oh. then they sent us another contract for billboards. But Ooh. we don't think it's been six months, or we think it's been longer than six months. So we have to do some investigation. Sounds like you need to have your agents reach out and your say, "Hey, attorney, Oreo, yeah, my CFO." You s no, not them. Yes. <laughs> no, you don't have your. She will CFO. get it no, done. <laughs> no, she She's will call financials. <laughs> she does mm -hmm. the financials. No, she'll just call Oreo and say, "We didn't get any money, but 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 I need your agent." But Brittany is my CFO. She will get it done. Yeah, but, That's right. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. This is where it's very important to know the distinction of a, a, a bummer, a Lazarus yep. versus a bummer yeah. mm -hmm. who gets stuff done. Listen, yeah. I'm a Lazarus, but and I still understand dreamer, contracts. Bummer, but a doer. A yeah, dreamer but, versus a doer. Anyways, I think you should have. How many contract law classes have you taken? More than you. Bull. How many have you taken? One. <laughs> That's a lot. It's a lot Take more than I want. How many? 
It's a lot more than I want to take. Yeah, because you only did one year at Georgia Tech. If you had done four, you probably would have. No, uh... probably none. So this video mm-hmm. is, um, so this was taken a couple days ago. Maverick City Music, who is a worship band, they were in Times Square and they were doing an Instagram Live because they were waiting for one of their billboards to come up. Cool. And so someone sent a screenshot of this and said, hey, did you know you're in New York Times Square? No. Is that it? New York yeah, Times Square? Yeah, just Times Square. Square. I was like, what? So I went back to the live and I screenshot this. Well, this That's isn't so a screenshot. Awesome. This is no, a movie. A, a video. I mean, I took a screen Kyle, like, screen, screen video. for the magic of television. All right, guys. <gasps> There's Allie and her dad in Times Square advertising Oreos. Yes. Wow. We made Times You're Square. Famous. That's so cool. How many? They should have put your your Instagram handle, and you would right? have gotten so many oh, followers. Dang it! I know. So how does it feel being a part of famous. just how the evils of capitalism? Yeah, consumer just like, culture. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got paid, so I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. All right. Like, I don't mean Wait. to be a I don't mean to be a bummer, but what's so special about the video? Uh, is that it's in Times Square. No, That's like, her. like, like of her and your dad. Oh, the dance. Oh. oh, it just was like a feel good, cute. Like it they was. just danced right. to Bummer and because, La- or to uh, Bruno Mars. Because I'm wondering, no. like, why can't Oreo just like have someone else do it real quick oh, if, right. they, if, if they want to keep using your video? Well, the thing, so the thing was, this particular one, this advertisement, they took a bunch of. Viral videos. viral videos that went viral during the quarantine to be right. like, look at how people are connecting and still doing fun things during quarantine. Got you. Um, and so this video with my dad and I, it ha- it went viral. So in over in less than twenty four hours, it hit a million views. Was it TikTok? Or Facebook? No, it was Facebook. Facebook. Were you serious? Well, yeah, which wild? is crazy. Oh, now wow, it's like thirteen. All the boomers something. loved it. Loved yeah. it. That's my Ooh. loved it. That's my angle. That's my yes. group. Those yeah, are my boomers. people. Yes. You know, me too. Yeah. So Most- now, so now they could. Oh, yes. Yep. Yeah, um, make another video, I guess, but yep. they don't have my dad. Me, uh, so. We do have a voicemail. Ooh. Oh, also, congratulations, Allie. Yeah, you. thank you. Allie and your Thank dad, you. You're Times famous. That was great. Ooh. We're just, we're just hoping. Do you feel your life that... has been changed at all by this? No, absolutely not. Mm. <laughs> life has not been when, changed. When... Other than a little bit richer. <laughs> just a teeny tiny <laughs> well, little drop. Well, actually, you didn't get a little, because like, this was after the contract. <laughs> You'd already been richer. You'd already been richer. Oh, this chick. Oh. Yeah. Well. Mm. But you. But your face has been on a video in Times Square. You are famous. Yeah, that's pretty cool. You're still my single. Mom, the I, old, still <laughs> single. That's rude. You know I, I feel honored to know you. <laughs> Thanks, Brittany. And I hope that when you make it even bigger than you already are, Thanks. you still remember us. Yeah. I will. <clears throat> Maybe not you. <laughs> forget but him as soon you. as possible. <laughs> That would be my advice to you. Just forget him as soon as possible. <laughs> the only thing was my mom was like, I'm so glad that I cleaned my kitchen counters. <laughs> well, that's, on that's fair. Okay, we have a voicemail. It's from the, it's the first one. The second you know one, from? the second one was to me personally. So we'll oh. play the first one first. Second one, one not. Someone said, what's up, ma'am, <laughs> to you? No, it's a translation. I was oh, making okay. breakfast this morning and I realized that relationships are kind of like boxes of cereal. When you were growing up, you had to get the kind that everybody else wanted or could agree on. You couldn't get 30 different boxes for everybody in the house. And you also couldn't open one box until it was completely finished. Who is this? That's kind of like a relationship, right? Everybody has to so agree to some extent. Is this Ian? As to what we're going to be eating for the next, I don't know, week or so. And... You can't open a box until it's done. You can't uh, move on to a relationship before this one's done. Or I guess you could cheat on somebody, but that's not good. Um, <laughs> it's not good. And <laughs> he laughed at himself. Out of another cereal box isn't necessarily cheating, but <laughs> the point still stands that relationships take mm. compromise. They take mm. a give and take, and just like choosing your cereal in the morning <laughs> as a family. Day crunch. <laughs> That's bad. <laughs> and then he hung up. <laughs> he just hung up. It's like I'm out. <laughs> I think that was Ian. <sighs> okay, okay. Thanks for the wise words, Ian. Uh, hot, hot take maybe about this. Okay. I think this is Ian's way of telling you he's quitting. His job. <laughs> are you choosing another cereal, Ian? Ian, are you, are you better ending not your be. relationship with us? <laughs> yeah. I do. I, you know, it's funny you say that because I do do this with Ian and other people where every every comment I read into, like someone texted me the other day, uh, oh, Koji is guilty of this all the time. He'll text me something and then not text back for a while and I'll read into it. So he just texts me 
and he hasn't texted me in months and just texts me randomly. Who's running the Catholic creatives account now? And I'm like, Oh boy, here it comes finally. Finally, the, the criticism. Someone, someone hates mm -hmm. it. So I go over to Catholic Creatives to see like what the post has been, mm -hmm. and I think like, oh, it's a video of Koji dancing. Then I look closer. No, it's a video of someone that looks like Koji dancing. <laughs> yeah. So yes. then I'm like reading into. It, I'm like, so I text him back. Me, nothing. Then I say, why? Nothing. <laughs> then I say, why do you hate me? <laughs> Good. That's a good follow up. I would do then the same still thing. nothing. Then I said, is it because of the person dancing that looks like you? <laughs> that looks like you. you no, mad? actually, I said, why do you hate people dancing? And then I said, please respond. Please, please <laughs> respond. Did he respond? Yeah. And then he finally was like, oh, no, I just uh, like they <clears throat> want to do the Catholic Creative Summit here, blah, blah. So anyways, related to this, like with oh. Ian, too, when I hear this stuff, I'm like, you're like, Ian's breaking up with he's me. He's breaking up with us. So well, what no, was I the gist he's breaking of what, up with you? So not he's us. saying relationships are like cereal <laughs> and he wants to throw away the box of cereal. I like if you're halfway this into is the cryptic. Oh, if you open another box of cereal while the other cereal box is open, that's kind of like cheating. But right now, I have two boxes of cereal open: a healthy one and Reese's Puffs. What does that mean? <laughs> okay, another question. It says more about is you. It, <laughs> is I'm it, an adult now. I get to decide because growing up, we could only have Honey Nut that's Cheerios. Right, that's right. Or the special one was Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Mm. That was like the fancy mm. cereal that we could get. And mm. now I can get cereal any damn time I uh, want to, Mom. <laughs> So the general is gist of this is like- Is it legal to smoke weed in California? What does it have to do with cereal? <laughs> um, I, I'm pretty sure Ian was- I know the laws of that. So you can <laughs> you can smoke weed in your own household. You can't do it in public though. Okay, <laughs> I'm. do you think that Ian did that before No, he, he... seemed perfectly- This uh... is a this is an Ian thought. Okay. Ian, if you would please call back and give and some clarify. further explanation. <clears throat> Maybe he's saying- We're having a hard time connecting the dots. Mm. We're looking for some synergy here. <laughs> Let's see. The relationships are kind of like pretty clear. I get it. No, you don't. Okay, yeah, relationships. If you think look, you get it, thing. you don't get it. Here's the thing. Relationships are kind of like boxes of cereal. Don't. Just That's what read I'm saying. It. Don't read no, no, the no. What, I, what he's saying okay. is that if everyone else wanted one, but you couldn't agree, you couldn't get thirty boxes of cereal. Like you had to kind of pick one box, and then you were stuck with that box till it was finished. Okay, okay. Meaning, <laughs> meaning you're friends with someone till they're dead. <laughs> say when do you in a relationship when is the Change metaphorically boxes. yeah it's, the box is it's finished. like oh well we finished our cereal so depends on what type of relationship with my wife when she dies okay or when you die which probably with you first. guys as friends whenever we'll see. you feel like it whenever I feel like it. <laughs> wait with us yeah as friends specifically yeah the two of us it's Brittany. <laughs> no i'm just saying some boxes of cereal like if you get a cheaper box of cereal Ooh, like an off-brand yeah you're like Pff. who's off-brand edmund who is yeah who like, would be an off-brand uh, i know the, like i know the cereal uh, yeah. the off-brand of edmund is that girl that i sent you a picture of that has the same haircut <laughs> as you that was wearing your sweater <laughs> Wait, that's not a cereal. That's a person. No, but but off-brand cereal. <laughs> oh, you're version probably, of me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. So off-brand cereal. Yeah, that's probably. <laughs> yeah, probably that girl. Yeah. <laughs> what, what about what's that guy's name who looks like Kratos was half as many uh, subscribers as us? Taylor Schroll. <laughs> yeah. Are you saying he's the off-brand version of me? No, I'm saying the numbers don't lie. <laughs> That's like hot. Yeah. That's the call. He's the That's discount it. version of Edmund. But he's got more beard than <laughs> okay, I do. Okay, okay. Yeah, true or false? Hair. True or false? It's not about the hair, man. True. Someone asked if you were single. Oh, gosh. Are we going to do this? And that person was a man. <laughs> We talked Wait, about this. Wait, what? Don't encourage Adrian what? to talk about this. No, I'm not talking about I feel like this, this is not going to go well. This conversation's what? ending. I just think it's really awesome. On the you show? You think it's or? awesome? I think it's fitting. We'll put in the after dark. Oh, which by the way, for our Patreon subscribers, we I put up that. the after the show show. No, the post show show. Yeah, it's called the post show show. No, it's, I wrote the title and it's- You wrote it wrong. You didn't even consult us. It's the post called, show show? Yes, the post show show. I don't think that's what we agreed on. That's, we agreed on the that's after what we the agreed show, on. The show. Tapes. Nope, we agreed Go on the post show the show. The after the show show. The post show show. So no, what happened? Post show show it was a stupid name, but that was the name we <laughs> See, thanks, Kyle. On. And it was my I'm idea, really and it was a great idea. We'll see you, next time. <laughs> um, you can't just play that <laughs> to shut us up. <laughs> but I did. Uh, <laughs> but we put it out there. I received it for, for our Patreon subscribers. You received it? Yeah, I'm a Patreon subscriber. Oh, wow. Well, yeah, what are you guys? That's super meta. I'm, You're like paying. I'm also a Patreon subscriber. Oh, that's true. And <laughs> I did not receive it. <gasps> Ooh. No, it, it, you did. You probably just didn't log email? in. Probably. I think I have it auto-routed to junk. 
Okay. Anything oh. you send me. <laughs> Right well, that's there great. was another photo that was in the notes thing, but now I don't see it here. It's anymore. all good. Well, I got breaking news. My second favorite podcast after this one just followed me on Instagram and is DMing Ooh. me asking me how my life is going <gasps> because I'm providing value, like commenting, and they're like, "Yeah, we followed you. Like, we want to talk to more about more about yes. you." Who's your? Dude, are you, can we say the name care. of the podcast? Valuetainment. Valuetainment. They're out in Florida. I think they're better than the Joe Rogan Experience. They're really rad. Ooh, I base a lot of our content take. based off mm-hmm. theirs. Mm-hmm. And their guy Adam Sostick, one of their. Uh, Host follows me now. He literally DM'd me, "Hey, how's trading going?" Oh, Dude, big up, big ups, Adrian. big up, big ups. Wait, what are you trading? <laughs> uh, you know. Crypto, stonks, crypto stonks, stonks. Oh. stonks, stonks. So that's that's some crypto pretty exciting. Stonks. So we can to talk more. Oh, let's play the go, applause. Adrian? Let's play the applause. I don't have an applause. We can talk real applause. Yeah, we can just yeah. Okay. Also, um, we could talk about how Adrian represented the studio and Bummer and Lazarus at Sarah Dietschy's, uh Yeah. Yes, I did Party. not make it to that. I was going to ask, what happened with that? Well, that's also going to be in the after show. Okay. Yeah. On Patreon. Oh. Patreon.com slash okay. the studio grapevine. So is this story in the after show as well? Ding. Yeah. Well, no, your story can be there. Gotcha, yeah. Gotcha. So you went. Give us the rundown. So yeah. I got off my barista job, right? And I'm like driving home because I smell like coffee. So like I'm changing clothes. I'm not really checking my phone to see if anybody's there. So when I start driving over there and I park, it's like there was hardly any parking. So I just park right in the front. I'm like, I don't care. I'm yeah. parking my car right here. I love that. I took my phone. No one's responding. Yeah. Like, all right, I'm lone wolfing it. Here we go. Man, so I then I just I walk in. I see a bunch of people talking. Like, these did guys, you have a camera with you? you- I, I thought about bringing it, and maybe I should have, but I didn't because I didn't know how confidential yeah. it was. So yeah, to yeah, sort yeah, of say. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like you didn't know how many famous YouTubers were gonna be there. Right. Yeah. So right. then I talked. So I I walked in. I was kind of like <laughs> looking for you guys. Like, all right, for sure, no one's here. Yeah. We so then I just chill in the corner, and I see this two co- I see these two couples, and I'm like, hey, where are you guys from? They're like, oh, we're from New York, et cetera, et cetera. Oh, then cool. these other people came up to me, started talking to them. Nice. Then I kind of gave the whole Adrian spiel why nice. I moved from California to nice. Texas, and love this guy that. was like in love with me. He basically wanted to kiss me, and I was like, Whoa. nah, bro. Wow. And then after wow. that, we got some tacos. Oh, we nice. got some beaded out tacos, pretty good fire. And then we kind of went close to Saraducci, but she was honestly like walking around, just taking like photos. And it wasn't like it was more so about like the the, the Michael. designer Michael. Didn't oh. get his last name, but Michael Shell Shellis. Yes, a lot of yeah. more, a lot more people were there for him. Interesting. Yeah, so, he was, was the, the designer one... of the studio. Yes, no, or. Of He's the inside mural. too, the I mural? think I think the mural or the inside. I'm not. I, I don't even know. Wait, was there a mural there? Seen the mural. You mean the mural on the outside of the building? Yes. Okay. Oh. Yeah. But a lot of people were just there for him. That's so cool. people were asking, "How do you know Michael?" I'm like, "I don't. I don't even know who Sarah is." Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm here. Just, my they, friends ditched yeah, me. <laughs> my friends, but it's okay. I'm um, I'm here, and I got talked to network some people. Some people work here on Main Street. Oh, cool. One of them was a financial advisor, so I'm meeting with three of them next week. So. Oh nice. my gosh, that's awesome! It was a fun time. So we definitely got to book a studio shoot at Minute. It'd be really fun, and just go introduce ourselves. Michael Shellis on uh, Instagram, Michael Shellis Creations, and he does a lot of really cool art. And um, he was the one that that DM'd me that we should go. I'm sorry that, I didn't get oh, to go. Oh, you know what? He did the one on Re- uh, Redefine too, right? Did he? The lion. I'm, the lion. Did he? Maybe. I mean, it looks it kind looks of like his stuff. It looks a lot like his know. stuff. I can. I can. I mean, this looks familiar. I can. Look I, him up I have a quick. picture of the one at Redefined posted. Yeah, no, I'm going to look at the Redefine So, one. guys, Grapevine, what we're trying to say is Grapevine is now the hub. It really is. It's like the New York Times. It is square. like the New York Times. Square mm-hmm. of Texas. It is. It it's is. kind of the Christmas capital of Texas. One yeah, Michael say. Shellis Creations. Wow. Did, he did the, this is the one from oh, Redefine. Oh, nice. Cool, 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 cool. That's, cool, cool, cool. He is all over Grapevine. Cool, we got to get cool. him on the show. Yeah, we, we should. Do. So, wait, that was Grapevine him? staple. Oh, my God. Yeah, he's the one that did the Redefine. Yeah, we should see if he can do... Uh, now we have to be careful. Walls. We have to be careful because we might potentially have another muralist. Can I say that now in 2021? Muralist? I don't know. Uh, I might don't have know another... if you say it confidently. Do people identify as muralists? That's not for me to judge. 2021. You can so judge we whatever. might have another muralist coming on the show as well. Who I talked to today. Really? Mm-hmm. Have both of them come on. <gasps> do and then do and a fight. battle. A, a battle. A mural, a mural battle. battle. This is a great idea. That could idea. be really cool. <laughs> <laughs> this is a great idea. That's like inviting. That would be really cool. Yeah, but that's you have to be careful. It's like inviting two chefs to a to a party. Have them duel. And then yeah. when they show up, you're like, hey, by the way, 
you're going to cook. No, 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 no. We're, let them we'll know tell them ahead, of, yeah. uh, ahead of time. Like, yeah, hey, you're going say, on a mural battle. No, I'm not doing that. But then that. would you say, like, you might be insecure because you're Listen, not a mural. You don't identify as a muralist. And so you might get lost in conversation because they're going to become best friends and then they'll exclude you. I'm oh. saying that if you're a chef and someone invites you over and then you show up and they're like, would you cook for us? You're okay, kind of like, this, or, if, or if you're a chef and someone says, would you come over our house and hang out? We'd love to hang out with you. Also, will you cook for us? Okay, this happens like, to me all the time. Pay me. As a financial planner, I'm not kidding you. Mm. Yeah, I do this to you all the time. This <laughs> happens to me all the time. People invite me places. And, and say, then they, while you're here. <laughs> <laughs> what should I do with my taxes? Yeah. yeah. Like, wow, you know who you are. If, you're, if you're like, you've you done this to me, you know who you are. Like, There's well, at least 20 Shane. people who have done Brittany, this. We're so glad you're over here. By the way, our 401k. By the way, here's yeah. us. I just had some questions. Yeah, totally. Happens all the time. really casual. Can you tell my wife that she's doing a bad job managing our finances? I think it would be really great coming from you. Yeah. So. Yeah. Well, that that's cool. I didn't know that there were, that, a that we might get a muralist. A mural. Yep. I'm looking at. I'm looking around for white walls to see like. Well, where we can already we know what we we want to do some stuff in there with the paint pens. I think mm -hmm. that would be fun. But again, yeah. we have to be sensitive because you don't invite right. a chef over and right. then tell them to cook. Right. right. So should we do our mural before or after he comes? Well, we definitely shouldn't do it before. Cause yeah, because we don't sucks. want him to see it. Because yeah. no, because he'll be a little insecure about. Well, his he own. will yeah. walk straight in and see your work of art. Oh, that's true. How you're, will that make you feel? We don't have lettering. to. We don't have to tell him that was me. Actually, no, I'm proud of that wall. You should be. I'm very proud of took that you, wall. You it took you a few took seconds to get proud. So long. <laughs> you should be proud of that wall. Yeah. yeah. Maybe he'll want to hire me. What if he wants to mural over it? I would say. Get out. What if he just wants to add a few? <laughs> I'd slap him. Oof. What yeah, if he, like some. Oh, he just I'm, wants a, to add I'm a, a collaborator. Like a, flourishes. Yes. Like I would have like some that graffiti over. Yes, that I'm could look cool. Honestly, that would um, be really cool. That could, that, this yeah. next segment, Ali, is called. Let's go to. I do have a video. Oh, okay. Let's play it. But it's. it's I a, swear to baby Buddha. Oh. <laughs> no, I swear to Buddha was not baby. Fat, shiny Buddha. Okay. That if the video you're about to play, what? now I want you to Shoots think. Shoots confetti. No. Shoots confetti. No, no confetti. Kyle. It's no confetti. If the video Allie's about to play is an attractive man from Instagram. No. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not. But I really. Okay, that is nothing. Is that the video? Oh. Okay, wait. No, watch. Watch, 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 watch. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let me Let me put it on the side. I wasn't sure if we actually wanted to show people that. Wait for it. It will play again. Oh, I get it. I love it. Oh, and you you brought some eggs for us to leave this, didn't you? I'm built different. <laughs> that is pretty funny. Oh my gosh, it's so weird. Whoa. What? Oh, shit. What? Get your, Where did these come from? Get your arms out. <laughs> Are we going to do this right here? Yeah. Okay, but don't worry. It's I brought gonna, this uh, to put This underneath. is going to be worse than confetti. No, no, we put this. Well, don't be crazy. I should have oh, brought three, maybe. Shit. Here. Do it over well, the towel. Okay. Kyle, did people see the video? Are they going to even know what we're doing? Yeah, no, they saw the video. Oh here, gosh. you can use this. You can use this Okay, towel. we can share this one. Yeah. yeah. You yeah, do yeah, it yeah. with your left hand and see. Why are we doing this? Because I want to see if you can do it. All right. These are cold. Here. Um, I believe Anna we, we sent me. We should do me, all, all of them at once, right? I believe Anna sent me this video um, to, to, for us to do it on oh. the show. Okay. So, the, Anna, this one's for you. This is going to be awful. We're oh. going to regret oh, this. <laughs> it is hard. <laughs> we're going to regret this the rest of the show, though. We'll just wipe no, it not. off. No, we're not. Okay, ready? Okay. Yeah. Ready? <laughs> okay, ready? Just make set, sure. Go. <laughs> Can you Whoa. I can't do it's this. very hard. <laughs> Ouch! How did she? <laughs> how did she do I it? That was almost all burned. I can't do it. It's so hard. Wait, I just said my to It's gonna come flying out. Ow! It hurts. It's very hard. Wait, hold on. I'm doing my non dumb How did she do it so easily? Do it. Hold on. Are these hard boiled? No, no. I swear. I swear. They are real. They're. I mean, they're. They're normal. Let me do my. How did she do that so oh, easily? It hurts so maybe, bad. Maybe they're warm. Okay, I'm gonna really try. Okay. I okay, have been really trying. Try. I haven't been really trying because I've been kind of embarrassed. <laughs> but now it it's hurts gonna leave bad. a. It's gonna leave a mark. This dumb egg. Oh my gosh! I did not think. Oh it was my gonna gosh! Be it's not possible. How did she do okay. that? Right. Wait. Let's watch. Let's maybe see. Maybe hers already had a crack in it. Watch where How hers is. Watch? It's not in the bottom of her elbow. It's but she's, slightly. But up. she's also very, very skinny. 
She's all bone. Bony? You think it's bony? Ouch. I'm not, I really she like just did this. She I like didn't even. Done. She just went. I know it always looks easy from the outside. Okay, Kyle, you try. You guys come try this. She just went like this. Wait, hang on. Yeah. Go to the camera. I got. Go to the camera. I got this. There's no way. See? Okay. That is wild. Over there. Wait, wait, wait. I'm lining it up. Okay. Okay. This is how she did in the video. Oh, oh God! No. Here, here, here. No. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Just leave it on the table. Don't. No, I wanted to cover it up. I didn't oh. want it to trickle. Wow, this is way it's a lot harder, harder than it I thought. Way harder. That's a lot harder. Than I was try so another close. one. Try another one. Wait, try. You didn't even give it a good college try. No. If you, How did she if do it, it then? Out, what do you? I think oh. you oh. Now it does Just look like again. it does look like a it she's does look like a thin egg. No, I think she. It's just a different kind of egg. No, I think hers is already cracked. I'll try this. Oh, gosh! You got it all over the... <laughs> but I did it! Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, get back on the mic. Get back on the mic, Kyle. Okay, Adrian, you So, want Kyle, to what do you attribute that to? Guys, it's literally in the video. You guys are not watching it closely. She doesn't she place well. it in the crook of her arm. Okay. Right. When, when you watch the video, you can clearly see the big muscle guy has okay, it in the center. Let me see. Hers is not totally in the crook of Adrian, her elbow. Do you want to, I'm afraid for Adrian to try. This was if you paid yeah, attention in too. science class in high school, we did a similar it's about experiment. Leverage. No, Whatever, it's about Kyle. an egg. If it's squeezed from the same force at all angles, it won't break. Oh, but oh. by not putting it in the bottom of her elbow, she's able to break it because it doesn't have that bit of your you elbow. Know what, Kyle? You got egg. Oh. Oh, oh my shit. gosh! Did the yolk uh, just yep. go on the carpet? Yep. You better suck that thing <laughs> off the carpet. Zamboni. <laughs> I'm very proud of myself because oh I gosh. said this was a stupid and not impressive I video, towels. and I knew it. I knew Get I could do it. Get the yolk off the ground. Oh my Wait, gosh. this one's hard boiled. No. No, none of them. Ah! Are. None of them are. Okay. I wasn't gonna drop it. Oh my okay. gosh. Oh. All right. Okay. How are you gonna get that yolk out of the carpet? <laughs> oh my gosh, this is the most disgusting episode of the show <laughs> of all time. That was fun though. That was. Oh, it's warm. Kyle. Right. Allie's ideas from the show went from went from mildly annoying to what were mildly annoying? Just the like the attractive men ones. That was not the attractive men. I did not find the first one with the singing guy. You did. That's true. I'm just so. saying. And now it's just like there's Inner yolk in shirt. the carpet. <laughs> okay. okay. I'm very proud of we'll myself. We'll deal with that later. Um, why don't you do another ad read while I go get something to get it, get the stuff out of the carpet? <laughs> All right, who are we advertising for? Gosh. Who are we advertising for? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Patreon supporters. Well, Patreon supporters. If you are looking for something to do with an extra five to five hundred dollars per month, mm. that's we, only like a couple cup of, cups. Yeah, of that's like a Starbucks or a hundred per month. And yeah. we would love your support because we have big plans, big goals and dreams here. Oh, oh, oh no, no, don't throw no, that no, one. No, no, oh, that this one, one got. Um, oh. if, if you're doing something with it right now, that is not a big deal. Here, we'll just. You got most of it. Yeah. Edmund's piss. Yes, that is your science lesson for the day. If you look at the muscle guy video, I'm gonna put it back up here for y'all to see it again. You gotta do it. Her. Watch where it is in her arm. His muscle is so big that it does not touch the crook he, of his elbow. He's the vacuum. All of you guys did it the wrong way. <laughs> she is putting the force on it. I think we can uh, safely assume to say I will not be bringing any more. Um, I think egg yolks is actually good for your hair. It's it is like good conditioner. for your hair. This was the oh, worst. Oh, you do your ever. masks. Your your yeah, hair masks. Yeah, you can. Does mm -hmm. that have egg yolk in it? Oh, look. Uh, what you did. No. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I brought towels. I thought I was being safe. <laughs> And then Kyle! That was Kyle's fault. <laughs> the first one was my fault. The second one, I was right. I have no regrets for the second one. The first one, many regrets. Oh, it's making me want to, like, it's making me kind of gag a you little bit. You don't like Really? I don't know, just like starting Raw to- Raw eggs? All right. 
So anyway, that's that segment. Joking, be careful. I'm Raymond Arroyo. We'll see you next time. <laughs> well, this has been fun. Y'all have never seen us vacuum before on this. <laughs> Oh, we vacuum. I vacuum after every single <laughs> no, freaking we, no, show because of the confetti. <laughs> we vacuum just like normal people. We have the same vacuum just like any other normal person. This we're is another just, great reason why you should watch just, the show in a video format. Yeah, so everything seriously. we just did doesn't make a lot of sense. We should. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I've never seen anyone <laughs> vacuum an egg yolk before. Well, I saw a TikTok video, so. Oh, I'm sorry. And I'll, I'll buy stuff to clean that. You know, Edmund, no, even though he's a man, he really mastered the angry well, mother you made a mess <laughs> vacuum just now. We'll just take this rug back to Ikea. <laughs> so what is this on there, sirs? <laughs> They'll take it back. Yeah, probably. Edmund returns stuff to Ikea all the time. <laughs> <laughs> That's all we have for the news. <laughs> what else do we have to talk about? Yeah, Edmund, what's new with you? Have you been to confession yet? See, now you're just kicking him when he's, he's down. I think he's That's killed not us necessary. a lot in his head. I need yeah. to go again. I, think, we already, we already, I think you need yeah. to commit, uh, or you need to confess some of the uh, hateful thoughts you had about us today. No, just me. <laughs> I got egg on me. Joe Rogan made comments about vaccines that made Dr. Fauci. Do you know, not everything after this just doesn't <laughs> feel the same. How do you feel about... How do I follow egg oh. yolk on the table? Mm. Should we talk about our summer hashtags? I didn't know we had them. <laughs> well, ours is hot girl summer. Oh, yeah. At one point you said hot croc summer. That was yeah. a thing. Are we still no? Not about that? I don't know. What do you? How do you feel about getting a croc tan? You know, like it looks, that would look it's awful. Kind of like a choco tan. Yeah. No, it's Except kind of the whole, way worse. It's just it holes looks all diseased. <laughs> yeah. So you would look like a leper if you had a croc tan. Oh, I got it on uh, my butt. Oh, here. Nothing else against lepers, but... Uh, um, what's your summer hashtag going to be? Brittany, <laughs> you know what I... Ooh. You're bringing this topic back up. We, this is for the After Dark show, the post-show show, if you will. And we will. It's going to be straight guy summer. <laughs> it's gonna is get, it? I was going to work on is getting it? straighter. Is it? <laughs> Are you? Straighter teeth. That, oh, nice. Straighter hair. Mm, how, how does one get straighter hair? Straighter body. Okay. You can't well, you know, some hair is not does not look. Straight. He doesn't mean like straight as in not curled. He means oh. like like wouldn't, an orienta- wouldn't an orientation. Be, wouldn't be hit on by other men. Oh, I see. Gotcha. You should stop plucking your eyebrows. Yeah. That's a good do advice. I do that too much? Yeah. They're a little overplugged. You know what's funny is that I haven't plucked them in a while. <laughs> I only pluck right in the in the center. Just don't. I don't do anywhere yeah, else. Okay. What are you talking That's about? Funny. What do you mean? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't do anywhere else. You're making this up. No, they look. Is great. this a bit? They really look is great. It? I don't do it anywhere else. <laughs> you should try to grow a beard. I've tried. I'm perpetually trying. <laughs> I'm always trying. You should get Rogaine for your face. Now I have thought about those little rollers. They make these like rollers for women that are trying to become men and grow like beards. What? Really? I think some men try to use them, but I really think honestly think it's what for is, like a What's in it? What's in the roller? I don't know, some type of chemical that's supposed to like hair growth, stimulate yeah. hair. Ooh. Interesting. I don't but it doesn't seem like real. Like it's not like it's very thin, wispy. Mm. Interesting. I know a guy who put Rogaine on his cheeks in college cuz he wanted to grow a beard. Did it Did work? Did it work? Yeah, I don't know if he just hit puberty, but oh, it well, worked. At maybe, some point, it maybe started Maybe you'll working. hit puberty this summer. Maybe if I put Rogaine on my cheeks, I'll hit puberty. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what, like, isn't that the chemical that comes out during puberty yeah. for boys? Rogaine. Rogaine? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm not a boy, so I don't know. Yeah, but I when know. a boy goes through puberty, yeah. his body creates Rogaine. <laughs> yeah. Why do, they, why do you think they sell them in the can? Because exactly. the guys who can't grow it, they don't have any more Rogaine. And so this company decided, mm-hmm. let's take that chemical out of little boys yep. and put it in a bottle and yep. sell no, it. No, little boys don't have it. Only adult of men pu- have it. Out of boys going through puberty. Yeah. yeah. That's smart. Unix. Unix. <sighs> What's that? That's, well, you can ask your Suppose mom when you're older. Show. <laughs> oh, Unix. Eunuch. Not a Unix. I thought you meant you. Well, I, I, I was a plural Unix. Multiple Unix. I know, but I thought in my head I read I read it as U N I X, like oh. Unix. Or no. Y O U space N I X Unix. Or Y O U space N I C K. 
K-S. Apostrophe S. Mm. All of you. those are wrong. You. Nix. Nix. Nope. I meant Unix. <laughs> <laughs> So well, Joe Rogan made some comments about the vaccines. He said like healthy people shouldn't like shouldn't be worried about going to get them. And I don't want to talk about vaccines, but I do think it's hilarious that Joe Rogan is like is like big enough of a platform that Dr. Fauci like came out and made comments about What did he say? Dr. Basically, Fauci? Yeah. He was like basically people should get vaccines like they should definitely get them because we don't want to carry blah, blah, blah. Yeah. But what's just hilarious is like Joe Rogan, who like is talking about whether or not aliens exist. Right. Has and is a stand up comedian. Influence. Yeah. Like wow. that, that Dr. Fauci was very concerned that people would take him mm. seriously. Well, people do follow. It, it is interesting how much people listen to celebrities opinions. Like think about this. Okay. Let's say some people do, but not like actual celebrities. Remember when the celebrities came out with that, like, like the um, imagine, imagine video oh, and yeah, everyone, everyone was like, this is dumb. Like, but imagine, imagine if you're like a nine year old kid and okay, your favorite <laughs> baseball player is, you don't know a baseball, baseball player, player guy. Do you? Joe DiMaggio. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Babe Ruth. Uh huh. And, but imagine he wasn't dead and he was <laughs> okay. um, like making a political statement, for example. It's a lot like for me to imagine. Supporting, but I'm there. supporting X Y Z political party. Okay. But you're like, but my dad is A B C political party. Okay. But Babe Ruth is way cooler than my dad, so I'm gonna be X Y Z political party. Okay. Like you might actually follow. Like you might take, even though reasonable people could be like, well, he's a baseball player. Yeah. What does he know about politics? Okay. But yeah, because he's this idol almost, he kind of, his opinion matters. But then people. you get people who <clears throat> like, it, like you have one side of like, why are celebrities are always doing this? But then you get people who are mad at celebrities who don't use their platform to that promote one or the other. So it's like, it's a lose loop. Like people yeah. got so mad at Taylor Swift because mm -hmm. they wouldn't like, she wouldn't publicly say mm -hmm. whatever. And so this, presidential election she said I, she made like cookies as so i'm voting for trump or um no no biden <laughs> no, not, <laughs> not <say> trump. That. <laughs> and so people were like finally but then we always then we have the other side of the coin yeah. of like oh my gosh that is just true need to that but, is true yeah but but the counter what britney was saying what if your dad's for abc party right but he's not a politician he doesn't know anything about politics that's true and then but joe rogan has all these people from different sides of the spectrums on the show telling him all these doctors and your dad just a dad mm. <laughs> Not my dad. So like, it's like, do you trust He's your a, dad who doesn't talk to a lot of people, or do you trust Joe Rogan yeah, who's talking to all point. these professionals? That's a good point. Yeah, what do you say about that, Brittany? But it's like, I don't know, my dad's dead. With. <sighs> yeah, well. Oh, he, he's a, <laughs> I, you know, matter. Brittany, you don't have to be such a, you don't have to be such a downer about it, okay? Yeah, right. Like, gosh, get over it. So I do think he's it's in a, a box in your room. No, he's yeah. in my office. We get it. <clears throat> yeah. So I do think it's hilarious how the White House has to monitor Joe Rogan. Just yeah. to make sure it doesn't say anything wild, but it's I don't know, like, it's, it's 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 interesting to see now and come out with like mm -hmm. a disclaimer censorship that means how Listen, much guys. influence he has. That's wow. Yeah, uh, that's how Who much. Who did Joe Rogan have. vote for? I don't know. He didn't. He didn't. Oh, he he didn't say. I, about it. I, he he didn't vote for either left or right. He said that. He's like I voted Ooh. for someone. Mm -hmm. He probably could be lying, but who knows? Probably voted yay. He probably yeah. I was gonna say he probably voted for Kanye. <sighs> yes. Knowing Show the hat, him. Kyle. Show the hat. Knowing him, president, sir. President, Easy. President West, President West. Do you feel like when you listen, to, do you feel like there's people like certain people, not celebrities is too, celebrities is like too weird of a word now, I feel like, but do you feel like there are people whose media you consume and you feel like you know them? Like you feel like, you know, like I bet there are people that listen to this show that feel yeah. like they know me mm. because oh. there's, they've maybe listened to years of me rambling on a microphone. And yeah. Like, I feel like, I feel like I know yeah. him. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff you don't know about me. That's true. Like what? Like, did you know? You hate eggs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't hate eggs. Actually, I, actually I, did really not, eggs. I did not know that. <laughs> I don't hate eggs. No, <laughs> he eats eggs all the time. <clears throat> but are there, do you feel like you know most I people so. whose who's media you really? consume? No, of course not. I don't know these people. Yeah. Like, it's like a musician. It's like, oh, I love Kanye. Kanye's put out like... 10 hours, 15 hours total of music. I don't know him. I if you like think about how fake it is, like if someone puts out an album about where they are, that album takes months in production, people feel different things. You I feel like there are celebrities media. though that are so visible online that 
you like people could easily think like I know what well, like, they're mm, like. Let's take Joe Rogan. Most episodes are more than an hour long. Right. But like, yeah. let's just say they're an hour and there's three That's a week. That's a lot of and there's, content. There's three a week of, times 52 weeks in a year. That's 150. That's probably more time than you spend with most of your kids. Wait, three a That's week crazy. times 52 weeks in a year. Whoops, sorry. Three hours times 52. Doing a podcast like That's 156 years, hours a year Yeah. That's that you're lot. like wow. listening to. And then. Yeah. Whereas like, let's say Brittany and I, we talk two hours a week. Yeah. I'm 52. It's not that different. Mm. Yeah, I- yeah, but we're but we actually know it. But that's I mean that proves your point. Like, if you if you listen to Joe Rogan every episode, you spend more time with him than you do with me, and we're actual friends. So are you actual friends with him? Do I know him? Do you know him? Do you want to know him? Well, I guess it's also. I mean, he doesn't like, know you. Unlike the person, how real they are. Joe Rogan says I am an idiot off camera, on camera, on yeah. UFC, yeah. comedian stand up. He showed up him, but YouTubers. Right? Are they the same person behind point. YouTube Ooh. camera, or are Kyle, they highly different? That's Kyle, do you feel like I'm the same person on camera as I am off camera? And before, to give you some time to think, uh, the first time I met Ian, and I should have him call in. We should call Ian. The first time I met Ian, Ian felt like he wasn't gonna like me. <laughs> what was his? What I don't know. I think because of some or? stuff he saw on social media, he thought like, "You're gonna be a jerk." Oh. A jerk. Kyle, do you feel like I'm the same person on camera? I think that you're I, very similar. I think you're a tad bit neurotic off camera, but also you're neurotic on camera. So, like, I think you're very authentic. But am I neurotic in different ways on camera? You are off camera? a little more put together on camera, I think, than you are in real life. Oh, that's true. I think on camera you just get a little more serious because, you know, there's, like, a record of it. I think you're a little more casual and jokey off camera, but mm. I think you're very, very similar with Yeah, both. you get canceled way more often off camera. <laughs> you know well. what's funny? I never would have thought that I'm more serious on camera than off camera. We saw what you did with the vacuum that was Sirius XM <laughs> yeah but I was playing the straight man like like yeah that's my point I brought You're the eggs serious. if I brought the eggs then I would not have I mean normally I'm the wild like and you know what's mm. funny is speaking of like being straight or less straight you Perfect. act way more straight on camera than you do <laughs> off camera <laughs> I feel like all of us you're though. fired. Especially, you're fired. All of us Especially when Nick's around. I'm more straight on camera. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's that's everyone. It's like you said, you're more put on. You're more put together on camera. Guys, I it? don't know what the hell they're all talking about. <laughs> I am not more serious on camera, and I'm not more straight on camera. You said it's straight guys. I feel summer. like I feel like it's like like Gary V. I feel like what you see on his show, like whatever you see on him, I feel like that's what he's like in real life. Mm. Like yeah, but, but here's the thing. Or is he that good at selling? But here's the thing, though. The way you are to so your mean. mom compared That's to the way true. you are with a friend. That's compared true. to the, it's not a, It's not a lie. You can change. Yeah. Well, but it's not a lie. It's just like you have a different relationship. Different facets of yeah, your personality. Like, like, like. That's true. Like you, like me and Kyle relate to each other in a different way than than me and Ali do, and so or me and Adrian. So when we're with. Like it brings out other yeah. parts of you. Mm. Yeah, that's true. You, that's you also why have to highlights. define what you mean by no. I think I have a pretty high definition of no here. I'm thinking mm. like, no, I don't know them unless I've like talked to them one on one about everything. When like that's probably too strict of a definition. Mm. Mm. Yeah, or think about people like that actor that came out and all these texts about like him saying he wanted to eat his girlfriend. Oh, and, stuff. The, and then yeah, like Arnie. It's like that whole thing. Like you think you know a person. Yeah, and then like mm. you like you know this person your entire life, but then you find out something about them He's that's cannibal yeah that like That's our, yeah so it's like did you really know him did you just know part well, of and him people always ask themselves that like how could we have not known like serial killers mm-hmm. or something like yeah i would have never guessed right right they're really good at hiding it yeah Psychopaths. and other people when they look at like serial killers and their families they're like how did their how did their mom and siblings not yeah. know that they were like doing some right. real weird stuff this reminds me of a related I was doing research for another project, but Walker Percy has a book called Lost in the Cosmos. It's called The Last Self-Help Book or something. And um, in it, he has this line where he's talking about how come you can look up at the stars, see a star, open up a book and read more about this star. Like feel like you know more about this star that you've never seen in your life that's millions of miles away and feel like you know more about that star than you do yourself and you've lived with yourself your whole life. Mm. And you feel like you know more about this thing. And then when you ask about yourself, you're like way more confused and 
Whoa. Stars aren't complicated. They're big balls. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Every human being is the universe onto itself. Oh, dropping Mm. bars, Kyle. Kyle. Well, I'm a huge believer in the power of the human person, man. That's true. That's not a a hot take. No, 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 that just was very profound. It was hot. It was. It just, it wasn't a hot take. It was just hot. (laughs) Different. See, this is why. I got a little hot under the collar. (laughs) This is why. I have 2% battery left. Oh, look, it's doing it right through the road podcaster. Wow. So say, does anybody cool. else think, do, do our listeners think any one of us are psychopaths? I think you are. <laughs> no, no. Someone who's not in the room. One of our listeners. No, I think they're fine they and think you're a that psychopath. We think that one of us is a serial killer. You. But. Do you, you would be, you would always be the one they didn't suspect. I'm yeah. really good. You know that game Murder? Oh, with the cards. Mafia, no, mafia, I, mafia. Yeah. <laughs> you know that game, <laughs> murder people? I can't believe Ian's dodging us right now. I th- really Your think has been forwarded I really think he was breaking up with us in that comment. <laughs> we need six, to confront him. Two, six, eight. You know that game? His number's five, playing on the... One, oh, five, don't listen! Ah! Ah! Is not available. He's a very private person. He wouldn't want At you guys to have his number. No. You know that when game called murder someone account. when they're not <laughs> no, looking? No. <laughs> Sorry, Mafia, Mafia, Mafia. For the record, his fo- everyone's Ian. phone number calls in the show is Ian. on the show. Yeah, well, you shouldn't show it up there. Ian, you're on the show. I like subtitles. Ian, we're, we're I know, but don't show voicemail. it in the picture in picture. Ian, we're, we, were, were, we wanted to know why you uh, hated us. Are you breaking up with us? Anyways, bye. Do you think we're serial killers? No, I hung up. I hung Edmund? Up. Maybe Edmund a little bit. No, he's he's created too many lives to take any. What? Edmund? Me? Yeah. Oh, wow, that was profound. No, I think the more kids you have, the more you're like, uh, the more you're, I can imagine. You're like, <laughs> you're like, let me leave this earth with a, like a net zero. So like you have five kids, you made five people. So you kind of kill five people. <laughs> so I can kill five people? Yeah, that's how serial no, killers that's work. Not, no, no, no. That's mm. not if you had so. to kill five people, who would they be? <laughs> One, <No>. two. <laughs> Is it because the eggs? <laughs> yeah. What's mine for? Just the, the straight comments. I think you'll know when it happens. You'll be like, oh, that's what it was for. Okay, yeah, I get it. Um, oh, man. So that's two down. Man, that sucked that Ian didn't answer. But um, I knew he wasn't going to answer. He broke up with us. Allie, do you feel like you know your dad? Um, I think I know him. Yeah, I think I know him pretty well. Yeah. Pretty well. Yeah, well, I mean... I think there's always going to be things, but I think we have pretty deep conversations, like like heart conversations. I just had a flash in my head of like, maybe that was a bad question to ask. And I just imagined you like just breaking down, weeping. <laughs> I mean, I do love my dad. Like that question would have went wrong. That question could have went poorly. I could have been like, do you feel like you know your dad? And then you just start weeping. <laughs> Did have therapy today. Like, no, I don't. I don't know him. And that's the problem. <laughs> no, but when I think of him dying, I do cry. Oh. No, I know you did it. D- don't even talk about it. I know. Don't, don't even. Don't. Last I will. the last episode that you brought that up, you started crying. I know. Well, you sa- you then asked if I could cry. cry. No, you asked if I could cry on demand. Oh, yeah. And I said yes, I can. When I think about this, and then I did. No, no, no. Mm. This is how it went. Yeah. I said, no, 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 no. This is how it went. This. Let me reenact. We've all been there. We were all there, including mm-hmm. all our listeners and mm-hmm. viewers. All right. Well, we'll go to the content you have ready <laughs> to talk about. Why don't we just go to the content <laughs> so you have prepared? What do you guys think about the? Rise in lumber prices. This is why. That's why. This is why. <laughs> that's so why I'm gonna murder you. That's why I'm playing the game called "When You're Not Looking." I'm murder. gonna murder you. That's just Suez Canal in a different. Font Actually, for me. yeah, that's true. Actually, you know what? Um, oh, I think if you could kill five people, you would just kill me and Allie twice, and then find a random stranger. Like you would use four of them on us. We bring you cake. Yeah. And then egged my table. <laughs> no, technically that wasn't us. And you didn't bring, <laughs> technically you didn't bring the cake. It was to the show gals, and if there was no show gals, there'd be no cake. Yeah. Okay. Fair. Okay, we should get those outfits, like a real show girls. No. Ooh. No. We're not <laughs> doing. Get all of our ideas out. Good. Okay, good. Get all the bad get ideas out. Get all the bad ideas out. Good, good, good. Let's keep them coming. Keep them rolling. Right. Introducing showgirls only fans. Oh, we oh. Okay. We could really raise some money for the Patreon. If our Patreon is show if its hands. If the showgirls pa- feet pics. <laughs> If our Patreon hits two thousand dollars a month, no, Allie and Brittany will start a segment on Patreon, only for Patreon. Yeah, it'll be an episode Phoenix. of the show. It'll be called "After the After the Show no, the- Girls Show." <laughs> The show. Feet pics. Oh and then gosh. the camera just going to be you guys' feet. Yeah. You guys going to be talking. Oh, okay. just from under there? That'd be kind of cute. That'd be cute. Yeah. Like the whole show's like going, but the like, video is under the table. Just like all, oh, us moving what around. Underneath. Yeah. Um, so this next <laughs> segment is called. Was that the neck? Did someone neck. Neck. Okay. This next 
uh, segment is called Random YouTube Comments. Uh, Neil Abbott says, it took me one hour and 28 minutes to figure out who Michael Hoffman reminded me of. He's a carbon copy of Jerry from Parks and Rec. Ah, now, Allie, does... That's mean. That Wait, is, is that I mean? am a... Have you seen Parks and Rec? That's funny. Yeah, but he's a funny... He's, he's a, a funny he's, No, guy do guy. you know Jerry? He's a fun guy. Everyone makes fun of him, and he's like... Yeah, but he's just saying he looks like him. Pull him up. Yeah, pull him up. I have I no don't idea know. I think about. I want to be offended at this. Why? Also, Jerry's a very loving person with his family and daughters. Yes. That's true. So a I can hot see that. Wife. Hot smoking hot wife My Jerry has. beautiful. Yeah. So like, And everyone's confused when they finally meet Jerry's wife. Yeah. Look. And he also becomes this guy mayor probably has of, like 50 uh, pounds on your dad. He's Money. a fun loving yeah. guy though. Okay, but he's also like everyone hates him on the show. This Haters is gonna hate. This is not Haters as bad. Hate. This is not as bad as I when get I get very defensive. This is not family. as bad as when I was on with Stan and I said, you know who you remind me of? Oh no. <laughs> and remember Kyle, I said, uh, who's the guy that played Gandalf in the Lord of the Rings? <laughs> Ian McKellen. So pull up if Kyle search Ian McKellen because the Google images were like awful. And they oh, and no. it was just me and Stan and Kyle. And you were like, what was he like? And it was like it was like really bad. You're like you look was, like this old bag of skin. It was like worse. Than, no, 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 go down to the one. <laughs> hey, Stan, right you know who you remind me of? This I was like, Stan, you look dude. like him. And we all looked, and Stan didn't say anything. <laughs> Like, that's not a bad photo, but there was a okay. really... This! Oh, no. And I was like, yes, Dan. And the, let me Why react Why is he it. kissing him? No, no, no. Well, because he's... Okay, don't... Why would you point that out? <laughs> he's gay. I was like, okay, let me reenact oh. that. Let me reenact that. I was like, okay. Stan, you look like... Oh, Ian, Ian McKellen, pull it up. And then this I came up. it was a publicity stunt. It was like this. I was like, Ian McKellen. <laughs> And then Kyle could feel the, oh my gosh, get it off. <laughs> Kyle could feel the awkwardness and Kyle oh. was just like, oh, or maybe someone else. Wait, is he, is he dating that guy that played I don't know. Voldemort? No, I no, don't no, know. No, no, no. Okay. Um, oh, but, but, um, you know, Stan, Stan like. no, also Stan looks like the, 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 guy? the, the second guy we in, um, Christopher Lee by saying that. No, in Parks and Rec, he is Ron too. Ron the, two. Ron, Ron two. Two. Yeah, from no no uh Eagleton. Is he from Eagleton? Yeah, yeah, yeah. From Eagleton. Eagleton. That's who he reminds me of. Celine on YouTube oh, commented But like less Tom weird. Selleck, right? That's no, no. Not oh Tom yeah, yeah, he Selleck. does look like him. He does look like him. Yeah, Tom Selleck's dad. <laughs> Wait, what's that guy? No. Tom Selleck is a real person. Uh, Sam Elliott, that's what I meant. Oh, I don't know who that is. That's um, him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. My mom Tom loves, Selleck is as old as this guy now, Tom I'm pretty Selleck. sure. I only have 1% him. battery Look. left on my phone, so we're going to have to end the episode soon. But Celine says, you guys really make me laugh. I listen to you while at work, and it makes my days better. Thanks, oh, Celine. That's sweet. Appreciate it. I Just wait the for best. this episode. <laughs> I wish you the best. Love the name. Good call. Not going with the obvious name. And oh. and so just comments. so you know, I'm officially a fan of Topo Chico now. Thanks. <gasps> We are disciples of oh, Chico Chico. Yeah. Spreading the word. So I've heard of people putting, um, you know, those squeeze little power, like mm. energy Mio yeah, yeah. things. I've heard of them putting black cherry mm -hmm. in a Topo Chico and mm -hmm. it supposedly it tastes like Dr. Pepper. Really? We'll yeah. try that next week. That's what they say. Brenda Hunt said episode. that last episode during the last episode with your dad, um, one hour and eight minutes in reminded her of a story where teachers revealed to deaf students that people can hear farts <laughs> and the conversation that followed. Have you heard that? Yeah, oh, no. I've heard that. That seems amazing. Oh, can you imagine no. being like a poor deaf kid and like, <laughs> you, don't know. you don't know, you don't know, you have no idea. I don't know. And then every time in third grade, and then the information is revealed to you. You think about all of all the farts the times. that you did. And That's the, like, oh man. Edmund doesn't care though. He, he'll like have his headphones on and just rip them. Yeah, we talked about that last episode. <laughs> he does not care. Joe said, I can only fit a Dewey Rhymes New Testament. Wait, one more time? <laughs> what was that? Let me take that again. <laughs> From the top? Right, and scene. Cut. Joe said, I can only fit a Dewey Rhymes <laughs> New Testament Better. in my back pocket. It's not a sword, but a dagger. Now, what do you think, Allie? Ooh. <laughs> oh, what's, <laughs> what's his point with that? Because it's know. tiny compared to like the USCCB version. I don't know. I guess. I mean, or the RSV or the NAB. He's commenting on our catechism. Um, do you reams? I thought that was no, a, it's Bible. a, it's a yeah. Bible. Yeah. 
Joseph says, just found y'all's podcast. This is awesome. And tell Allie, Mike said hi. Side note, you definitely need to bring Mike on. Now, what do you think the username of this person was? <laughs> Not Mike. Who is Mike? Joseph. I... Joseph? Is it my... Joseph R word. Last name. <laughs> Wait, who's <laughs> Mike? I don't know. Mike says hi. We're going to have to figure that out. Who we'll show her the comment. Let me see the user. Do Wait. I... I don't know who that is. Well, let's bring him out. <laughs> Joseph, Mike come on out. Hi. Show Allie Who's Mike. Mike? I don't know. What if he was that guy that you want to date with that you like talked about on the show? <laughs> I, I, hope he, I don't think he watches what's this. His name? Oh, what's his name, Mike? Did say no. Mike says hi. Okay, it, was right, not, right. it was not Mike. Because okay. how awkward I, would that we be? We got a lot of com Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> blows a wide open folks people are not gonna want to date me because yeah, if it doesn't work out we're gonna talk about them on the show <laughs> person put your neck <laughs> yeah you're gonna be like taylor swift like people won't want to yeah, want to date you exactly. because like they don't want a song written about them yeah i'll just talk about them on the show yeah. very similar lives that we pretty do. much you yeah. were a lot like taylor swift i am all right guys I think this has been a good episode how many minutes in are we 700. <laughs> Kyle? An, an hour and change. Oh. Nice. Like, go, time guys. flies when you're having fun. Time flies when you're All right, cracking so, eggs. Uh, bummer Lazarus. Oh, we launched the Instagram account like really hard officially. How many, yeah, how many followers do we have so far? Well, 11? Those 12? are vanity metrics, Brittany, so we don't really care. 13? But we do. Like 100 and something. Up in, up in numbers, not the content. Yeah, Ooh. it's about the content, Brittany. I mean, the photos have looked pretty bomb. It's Thanks Bummer and Laz. Yeah, Bummer and Laz. Sick. And our graphic designers. Yes. So good. It's Bummer and Laz. One Bummer word. And Laz. Bummer and A M. Okay, guys. Um, this has been a great Follow episode. Follow us at Bummer and Laz. Follow us at Bummer and Laz. Um, we will see you on another time. For our 100th episode next week. Yeah. What are we going to do? Oh, we're going to celebrate. We're going to celebrate. We won't bring confetti. We'll bring big confetti. No, I'm just kidding. We won't bring... We'll do something else. All right. Won't Bye, be guys. Glitter. Wrap it, up. it could be glitter. It won't be eggs, but it might be confetti. Talk to you later. Bye. Lift off of Discovery. You're going to die. I'm Raymond Arroyo. We'll see you next time.